Hey YouTubers, what's up? Bart 49ers Corner. I'm making another attempt at this video. The YouTube capture app kills me every time. Uh, I'm shooting on my iPad, so the picture might be not by quite as good. Uh, but the phone, I just it's not doing anything. So, uh, what I got for you today is yesterday my pickups completed two sets that I was working on. One's a legitimate set, which is the Jimmy Johnson uh, basic set. Uh, each year of his cards, and then the other is kind of what I recognize as the Montana Tops Basic Set. Uh, the actual one on PSA Registry is 85 cards, but you know a lot of weird knickknack Tops cards. Most of there's about 30 or so stickers, so I don't really I collect them. I have some of them, but I don't really you know recognize them as the the bigger cards. So um, I'm going to show the Jimmy Johnson. I know most of you are looking forward to the Joe Montanas, but I am a vintage guy, so I'm going to indulge myself and show off some Jimmy Johnson's. Actually, i got to go in that order. I'm in the wrong order because I shot this already. <laughs> um, starting off with the 64. I'll try to get the glare off here. 64 Hall of Famer, Jimmy Johnson, Philadelphia, and an 8. I'm sorry. Looking to upgrade that, obviously. Only 22 of those to upgrade, though. Here's the 65 in a 9. Here's the recent pickup, the 66 Philadelphia in a 9. The 68. This is a low pop one. Uh, let's say maybe 11, but none higher. That's in a mint 9. Here's the 69. Uh, I'm not sure what the pop is on this one, about a 12 or something like that. Mint 9. I uh, don't think there's anyone any higher on that one. Here's the 70 in a 9. There's the 71 and the 8. Obviously, these are real hard cards to get good in high grades. And the pop of uh, the mint 9s are just 5 uh, and none higher. And there's only one 5 listed right now, and it's for like 450 bucks. So, not cheap cards. Well, favorite set of mine here, 72 tops. That's a mint 9. And we got the 73 and a mint 9. One of the more affordable sets out there. 74 is pretty good as well. That's a mint 9. And then at the 75 and a 10, pop up 3. So there's a Jim Johnson basic set. Number one on the registry for that one. So pretty proud of that finally finishing that one. But we'll get into it. Here's the Joe Montanas. Uh, I'll start off at the 81 and I'll take you up to 95. Got everything except the 94. Because I have that one in an 8. Still looking to get that in a, a 10. There's 9s out there, but I, I just wanted to get the 10. I, I did the self-submission and got the 8. It didn't work out too well. But that's not really what I consider one of the bigger cards anyway. So I will show you all the big cards along the way. And there's only two 9s in here. The rest are 10s. Obviously, here's one of the 9s. Uh, the 10 would cost about three or four grand, and I ain't seen it yet. But uh, not that I'd pick it up if I saw it necessarily right now. But uh, Mint 9 in Rookie. 82 tops in a 10. Put a stack on 82 tops in action in a 10. 82 tops passing leaders in a 10. A recent pickup here. 83 tops in a 10. Probably my favorite of the bunch just because it's the lowest pop. Uh, since it's not the main base card of the year, a lot of people don't go after them, so they don't carry quite as high a price. But pop of 11 on this one, the 83 record breaker. So I'm pretty proud of that. That's a very low pop for a Joe Montana card because uh, a lot of people get them get them graded. So uh, tons and tons have been graded. Here's the 84 base in a 10. 84 instant replay in a 10. One of my favorites, and I know a lot of you guys you guys like this set if you can get them in a good grade. Here's the 85 tops in a 10. That's a pretty pricey one there. Even better yet, the lower, much lower pop, only 17 of these. The Dan Marino Joe Montana League Leaders in a 10. Another hard one here. 49ers Team Leaders with Joe in the middle there in a 10. 
Here's the other nine I got to show you. It's the 86 one. There's only six of these in tens, which is by far the hardest one to get because there's 67 tens in the uh, in the rookie card. There's only six of these. Four of them are on the registry uh, for guys that collect the the Joe Montana set, and all of those guys are millionaires. And I think two of them, at least one of them, but probably the top two of them are billionaires as well. So good luck competing with those guys. Uh, the 86 league leaders in a 10. 87 and a 10, 88 and a 10, 88 record breaker and a 10, 88 passing leaders with Bernie in a 10, 89 and a 10, 89 team leaders Montana on the run in a 10, Montana back to pass Super Bowl 23 in a 10. The 1990 base in a 10. That one's more pricey than you would think in a 10 version. There's the record breaker in a 10. That one's not too bad. This one's an easier one to come by. 90 league, league leaders. The boomer in a 10. The 90 team leaders in a 10. The lone 91 base card, or 91 card, uh, Joe Montana. In a 10, that's more pricey than you would think, too, for a close, kind of a more modern era card there. 92 tops in a 10. He's got two 93s. Both of them go for a pretty good penny there. So if you've got these lying around, you might want to get them graded. In a 10. And then still got to get to 94, but here's the 95 in a 10. So. That's the Joe Montana PC showcase. Uh, thanks, guys, for watching. Figured some people get a kick out of that. And uh, if you see the 94 one, let me know. But that's what I got for you. Thanks for watching, guys. Take care.